That's right, my friend. Let me ask you, does a machine like yourself ever experience fear? Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome to another video of Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2. Hope you guys are having a wonderful day. My name is Ventus and I have a question for you. Okay, what is your legit 100% most hated Super Soul in all of Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2? Now, me personally, if most of you know me, you've been subscribed to the channel, you've watched some of my videos, you know how passionate I am. Passionate I am about perfect blocks. So naturally, I will turn back time, the Wii Super Soul that you perfect block and you gain health back, that is quite literally the worst Super Soul in the world to me. I hate that Super Soul. And then there is, I'm either Kami or Piccolo, I hate that Super Soul. But when I was fighting, Ed Smooth 23, I tell you, I, I, I S you not, boys and girls. Him, 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 that Super Soul pissed me off, bro. I was fighting this guy, and as I'm fighting him, bringing his health down, I'm thinking to myself, like, wait a minute, why is his health not, wait, I've been putting in work on this dude, what, what, what's good? So I happened to pay attention to what was going on, because I never really pay attention to, to anything other than the fight, and how I'm gonna combo them next, or, you know, how I'm gonna finesse them out of their stamina, and then, you know, I look over, I'm like, damn, he's got the him, him, him Super Soul, man, I thought that died out uh, in, in the 80s, when, when Nixon was in office. Wait, was Nixon an offense in the 80s? I, I don't know. But anyways, so yeah, that pisses me off. It, it, it annoys the crap out of me. And this is the reason why. See, there it is. Him, 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 Super Soul. This is the reason why that makes me so angry. Well, not really angry. It just annoys me. It's the fact that I feel like it's very disrespectful. Whenever I do PvP against somebody, and let me know if you're different about this. Whenever I fight somebody PvP, I don't like that they can heal. I never liked healing in any of my fighting games. I mean, well, maybe in DC Universe Online when I had Rage and Rage Power, when you fight somebody, you gain health back as you took damage or whatever. Maybe that was a little bit acceptable. But when it comes to Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2 and like some of these other fighting games, I don't really don't like the healing. Dragon Ball Fighters has a little healing aspect to it, and I guess that's okay. You can only, it's like a one time thing. But in Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2, I turn items off because I don't want somebody to heal. It makes me feel like they're disrespecting me in a way it's like boom you did all this hard work on me you finessed me out of my health you finessed me out of my stamina and i'm just going to use a move that's going to gain back my health or stamina that move that brings back their stamina i tell you what man they need to take that out of the game <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry I, i'm sorry i hate to sound as douchey as, as i do but i think that that needs to be removed because finessing somebody out of their stamina is oftentimes very difficult especially when they have a lot of a bar of stamina follow me down a rabbit hole let's say you're fighting someone who's actually good at the game like a tunnel vision hd or, or maybe a super saiyan cavi 28 those are two characters that come to mind that are very good at the game what if they used something that gave them health back gave them stamina back you know the average player and i'm not saying that you watching this video you specifically you are any better or worse than anybody else in the game but let's just say the average joe who's playing they are okay they're not od you know spamming it 24 7 and they should happen to fight one of these people that are very good and they do all that they can use all that they've learned playing with their friends and they finally finessed a tunnel vision hd out of his stamina to where he's down to one bar or they finally beat a super saiyan cabby 28 down to where he's you know at at 30 percent left of his health it's hard to get individuals of that stature, of that playing ability, to that level. What if they just popped one of those moves that brings their stamina back, that brings their health back, and you've turned items off so they're not supposed to be able to, to do that. You finesse them as best as you can, and then they bring it back, and it was hard to finesse them. So that's why I don't like those types of moves in the game, and I realize it. It's a part of the game, Ventus. Stop complaining, GFG bum. Just get good. Okay, I get that. I get that. But in a fighting game such as Xenoverse, I feel like if I have finessed you out of your stuff, I need to reap the benefits of that. And honestly, when fighting Ed's move, now this preset, he's taking the, the super soul off that, that heals him. When I was fighting Ed's move, it annoyed me at first. But during the course of that match, because I only fought with him like two, once, or two or three times, I can only fought with him two times. But during the course of that match, it became something else to me. It became more of a challenge to me 
to win the battle knowing that this dude is healing and it was okay because i'm not trying to toot my horn or say that i'm any better or worse than anybody but it just felt like when fighting ed smooth 23 shout out to you buddy it feels like i just had the upper hand maybe my stats are a little bit better maybe i have a little bit more experience at the game so it became a matter of well damn he's healing back so what I have to do is I have to not die and deal with this healing. And it's okay because I feel like I can win the match. And it was okay anyway because, you know, I felt like maybe he needed a little bit of handicap, I guess. So I don't know. So definitely Hem 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 is a super soul that's in my top five dislike super souls. Now I can see if you're doing something PvE, maybe an expert mission or a raid where Hem 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 came in handy and it heals you back where you can't really do any healing or maybe, you know, you have a... a finite amount of healing where you can only use like you know three or four healing items or whatever like that so maybe it's good there but in pvp i just don't think it should be a thing what do you think what are some of the super souls that you dislike what are some of the super souls that you actually like there are only a few super souls that i that i that i mess with that i really enjoy lately i've been using my key is building overflowing actually that was a super soul that was a Z soul back in Xenoverse 1 that I really enjoyed because you start the match with full key. And because I've been using my Super Saiyan 3 Gogeta uh, costume on Gohan, yeah, that's what it is. I kind of like to start the match and transform into a Super Saiyan 3 as early as possible. And having my key is building overflowing kind of, you know, helps me on that process. So my key is building overflowing, definitely one of my most favorites. Um, the let's just enjoy the game right now. I really don't see too much of a use for it anymore because I don't know if the word got out, but people play fair now. And I think I'm one of the last remaining bums to have on a, a fake blast, you know, um, fake blast, dragon burn, and what's the ice one? I think people have really come to terms with if you use those types of evasive moves, that's that doesn't reflect you know good on you it doesn't say you're good you just have a, a, a cheesy super soul so i mean a uh, evasive move i have got to break myself of the habit of using fake blast i really do i feel like whenever i use my cac i kind of have to use it but it i shouldn't well, like, do you have any suggestions like in the comments below let me know what you think about a, a evasive move that i could use i mean i feel like the only reason i use that super soul or that uh, evasive is to make a person waste stamina it's like an extra thing to make them waste stamina and i feel like as i'm making this video that having fake blast is equally as bummy as having that move on i don't know what it's called uh, the move that gives what's the name of that move that gives you back stamina I, I think that's a bummy move to have i think that i should probably compromise with myself if i'm gonna not like an individual to use that move i should probably take off fake blast what do you think i don't know let me know down in the comments below all of your thoughts on these things that are said. And uh, rank these players. What do you think of Ed Smooth 23? What's his rank? And if you think that, uh, you know, you could probably be some help to him, you know, send him a message and let him know that I sent you. Send him a friend request. Play with him a little bit. Same thing for, what is this dude's name? Teen of the South 18? I'm not trying to be rude, but Teen of the South 18? Thank you guys so much for watching. I will catch you on the next video. Thank you for watching, man. And please uh, like, comment, and subscribe. Peace to the out. 50 levels deep.